Hey everybody, it's Brandon here from betteratEverything.info again, and this is part two of my AutoCAD Basics series. In this video we're going to cover creating a new drawing, saving a new drawing, and opening an existing drawing. It's going to be a quick video just to get you started here, um, so let's go. Uh, to create a new drawing in AutoCAD, uh, it's as simple as going up to the top here and clicking the page button or going here and clicking new. Now you get a choice between drawing and sheet set. We're going to choose drawing. Uh, now it's going to ask you which template you want to base your drawing on. Uh, templates will include everything from uh, specific units uh, like you can open an imperial or a metric one. Uh, you can, They can include different plot styles which are uh, how a printer deals with uh, line colors and line weights as well as uh, line type scales and thicknesses and they can uh, they almost always include uh, your title blocks and your page setups uh, for this example we're just going to use the basic AutoCAD uh, template it's acad.dwt uh, you're going to select your template make sure it's correct down here and click open. And there you have it. We have a brand new AutoCAD drawing. Uh, we're in model space right now, which is where you're going to do all your drawing. Um, it's blank. It's easy to easy to start a new drawing. So we're going to draw uh, a quick little shape here. Uh, don't worry what I'm doing here. This is just uh, for the example. There we go. Quick uh, P line. Now we're going to save our drawing. Uh, don't forget to save often too. While you're working in AutoCAD, you're going to want to save every 10-15 minutes. Uh, it's as simple as going up top here and clicking the, the floppy disk. Save. There you go. You can also uh, just hit, uh, hit this at any time or also type save or Q save into the command line. Uh, so we're going to save right now. It's going to ask us where we want to put it. Uh, I suggest creating a bit of a file structure to save your AutoCAD files on your hard drive so you don't uh, lose them. Uh, I like to create a, uh, a basic folder in my documents called AutoCAD. Uh, this one I've got, it's AutoCAD Tutorials. And then inside there I make a new folder for each set of drawings I'm working on for each project. Uh, for this one, this is... Uh, our AutoCAD Basics series, so I'm going to call it Basics Series. I'm going to open that one, and that's where I'm going to save this drawing. Uh, this is part two in the series, so I'm going to call it Part Two Tutorial. Uh, you can choose the file type. Uh, you can choose between various years of uh, AutoCAD DWG drawings as well as uh, drawing standards, drawing template, and then DXSFs. Uh, typically you're going to just save in the default 2010 drawing unless you plan to send this drawing to someone you know that has an earlier version like 2007, 2004, or even 2000. Uh, not as common anymore, but a lot of people are still on the 2007s. Uh, once you've named your drawing, you're going to click Save and you can tell if your drawing is saved by looking up top here and it'll have the drawing path with the drawing name at the top of your screen. Uh, that's also handy if you're not sure which drawing you're in if you've got multiple drawings open. Uh, it's just a nice way to double check and see which one you're in. Uh, so there you have it. That's creating a new drawing and saving a new drawing. I'm going to close out of our template drawing and a blank one I've got open here. I'm not going to save that one. Oh, looks like I've got two. I'm not going to say that one. This is a blank AutoCAD screen with no drawings open. Um, from here, I'm going to show you how to open an existing drawing, which is the one we just made. You're going to go to the top, and you can do this at any point in AutoCAD. These, these uh, buttons here are always up there. You're going to click on the Open folder. Uh, it'll go to the last folder you're in, but let's say uh, it just took me to something else. You're going to find your folder, which is AutoCAD or whatever you've called it, the folder your drawing is in, and then your drawing. It gives you a little preview right here. 
so you can double check and make sure that's that's the one you want. You can also select the initial view. Um, I don't find it all that useful. Uh, select your drawing, make sure it's correct at the bottom, click open, and there you have it. We've now created a drawing, uh, saved it, closed it, and now you can open a drawing as well. Uh, that's it for this part. Uh, make sure you check part three, and thank you once again for watching. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, uh, feel free to comment on the video or check out the site at betteratteverything.info. Thank you.